so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! And today we're at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona. This is gonna be awesome. I think today you and I should learn about some animals. Whoa, look at this place. Whoa, those are kind of like raindrops. Hello. Okay, let's go over here. Ooh, we're almost to the top! Whoa! Yeah, let's go! This is gonna be so much fun! Oh, did you see that? I just used two fingers on the back of the head in the back of this Russian sturgeon. Oh, it looks like he liked it. Whoa, it feels so cool. It's hard, but it also has kind of a layer of a slippery sludge on it. <laughs> it helps keep all the parasites away. Oh, here's another one. That is awesome! <laughs> Whoa, did you see that? I just touched the stingray nice and gently with my two fingers on its back. Whoa, okay, let's, uh, let's touch another one. Oh, here's one right over here. Oh, oh hey! Whoa, <laughs> that's silly. Ooh, come over here. Whoa. There's so many of them. Whoa. Look at that one. It's just resting on the ground. That's a different kind. Huh. Oh, here comes one. Whoa. Hey, I'll describe what it feels like. It kind of feels... Oh, here's one more. Whoa! Yeah, I really know what it feels like now. It feels like a wet gummy bear. <laughs> oh, so slippery and soft at the same time, but firm as well. Wow, <laughs> this is fun. Whoa! Oh, hey! Hey, Blippi, what are you doing? Oh, just sitting here looking at my favorite fish, the paddlefish. Ooh, paddlefish? That's pretty cool. It is. Well, see you later. Oh, see you later, Blippi. Whoa, this is pretty cool being behind the scenes of the aquarium. Hello. <laughs> this is awesome. Whoa. <laughs> hey. So many cool workers here. Whoa, look at this. We're on top of an aquarium! Whoa, look at all that water and those fish down there! Whoa, okay, follow me. Whoa, look at this room! Whoa, there's so much scuba gear in here, tanks, wetsuits. Whoa, okay, we need to take this fish to the sharks. I bet they're really hungry. Come on! Whoa! Wow. Okay. Whoa, look at this. Whoever drew that is a good artist. It shows the different parts of a shark. Yeah, like the gills. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, look. All right, we did it. Here you go. Hi, thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. What's your name? My name's Danny. Oh, this is Danny, and what are you doing here? So we're here in She's actually feeding our big sharks right now. Whoa, look, I see a fish down there, look. Whoa, so why, why is she holding a fish on a pole? So that's how we get the food down to our sharks. If they're already low in the water column, she needs to be able to have a really long tool to get the food down to their mouth. 
Okay, so they hold the pole, which has a fish on the end, and then the sharks come up and have some supper. <laughs> Ooh, this looks like fun. Whoa, those fish look big. How big is that fish that she's feeding the sharks? It's about this big. It's called a blue fish because it has a kind of blue tint to it. Okay, that's a blue fish. That's about this big. So, what kind of fish did I bring up? So, you brought up some herring, which is the big fish in here. Okay. And then some caitlin, which is the little fish in here. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Oh. Okay. Well, this is pretty cool seeing someone else do it, but hey, can I feed some sharks? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay. Just make sure you have your gloves on because the fish can be kind of stinky. <laughs> Okay, all right. Let's put the gloves on so then my hands don't smell like fish for weeks. <laughs> okay, all right, I got my gloves on. Uh, oh, there we go. One glove, two gloves. All right, and now what do I do? So we'll just take this fish bucket that you brought up from our kitchen and we'll head over here. Okay, all right. Okay, all right. We'll head over to our feeding platform. Okay. As soon as we walk up, the fish will be all ready for us. Okay. Whoa! Look! I'm on the platform. Whoa, look! There's no barriers between me and the fish. Okay, I'm just gonna jump in. Oh, no. <laughs> just kidding. All right, here we go. Can I throw one at a time? Yeah, whatever you want. Either one at a time or all of it at once. All right! Enjoy, fish! Whoa, look at them go! They're really enjoying this food! Whoa, look at all of them! They're swarming to the top! Because they know that I'm throwing all this yummy food to them! Alright, whee! Whee! Whoa! Here you go, fish! Is that tasty fish or is that tasty? <laughs> okay, just a little left. Here we go. Whoa, that was so much fun. <laughs> Good job. Whoa. Ooh, she's feeding a turtle. Come on. Whoa, so many cool things up here. Whoa. Okay, let's go over here. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay, what are you doing? I am feeding Greta, our green sea turtle. Ooh, she's feeding Greta? That's a nice name. And this is Greta. Do you see Greta? Hey, Greta. Hey. Ooh, what does Greta like to eat? Greta loves lettuce. Also enjoys cucumbers, bell peppers, and even sometimes carrots. Ooh, lettuce, bell peppers, cucumbers, and carrots? Sounds like Greta's really healthy. <laughs> Can I try feeding Greta? Yeah. Hey. Okay. All right. How do I do it? Just a little bit? Yeah, just a little bit. The whole leaf. You just pop it in front of her. Okay. There you go, Greta. Whoa. Hey, what are you doing? It's time to. Should I throw another one? Sure, there we go. Sometimes you get them from here. Okay. Alright. Greta's hungry. Here you go, Greta. Yum! Here you go. Oh, Greta is really big. Do you know how much Greta weighs? She is a little bit over 100 pounds. Oh, wow. A hundred pounds. Wow. Oh, here you go. <laughs> okay, let's do a big piece. Let's watch Greta eat a whole piece. Here you go. Oh, it's right there. Yeah. Whoa. Hey. <laughs> Hello. Whoa. That's a big piece of lettuce. Hello! Hey! Hello! Come on! Since we just 
touch some animals. I think we should use this restroom and wash our hands. Let's go. Okay, welcome to the bathroom. Whoa, look. Whoa, look. This restroom is underwater. And this restroom actually won the best restroom in America. Whoa, you can wash your hands right here. And look at shark, sharks and fish. Whoa, this is awesome. <laughs> Pretty cool. All right, I wash my hands. Now I'll go dry them. You enjoy the view. down the escalator to the deep ocean. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, look. Now it's like we're underwater. Look this way. Oh, that's awesome. I present to you the Deep Ocean Exhibit. So this is a sea lion. Oh, there's another one over here. Oh, it's so big. Oh, it's so cool. Oh, look, look, look. Oh, hello. Whoa. And there's actually a seal in here as well. Let's go try and find it. Oh, let's see. Oh, here it is. Hello. See that right here? This is a seal. Hi. So there's three sea lions in here and one seal. And the easiest way to tell the difference is this. I'll show you. So if you're a sea lion, you use your front flippers to basically walk like this. <laughs> but seals don't do that. Seals, oh, hello. Oh, you're curious, huh? <laughs> so curious. Whoa, so that's a sea lion. Mm -hmm. So it walks with its flippers. Hello, 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 hello. They're actually really smart animals. See how it's following me? I'll try and change directions. Whoa! <laughs> okay, and seals, they don't walk like that. You know, this is a sea lion. Sea lion. And a seal, they don't have that much power right here. And it's kind of short and stubby. So this is what they do. They just kind of waddle. <laughs> That's silly. Wow, what magnificent creatures. Check them out a little bit more. Whoa, penguins? Yeah, we're behind the scenes at the aquarium and we're gonna meet some penguins. Come on. Let's walk nice and slow, and we'll be very quiet as well. Ooh, hey, who are you? Hutch. Ooh, this is Hutch. Hey, okay, what do you do here? I work with the penguins and reptiles. Ooh, the penguins and the reptiles. Oh, do you see the penguins back there? Oh, hello. 
Are these your only two penguins here? Oh no, we have more friends that are coming. Would you like to grab a toy? We're actually going to play with them. Sure. Okay, let's grab a toy and let's see some more penguins. Look over there. Also, can see colors really well and have rods and cones in their eyes just like we do. Okay. They're kind of, although they're birds, they're kind of acting like kitty cats, huh? Just a little bit. They do like to play with a lot of different types of toys. And just like kitty cats, they tell us when they want to be touched. Okay. Huh. Interesting. It's pretty cool. Hey, get a closer look. Oh, bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> penguins are so silly. So where are these penguins from? These penguins are from South Africa. Okay. And we have 32 of them here at the aquarium. Wow, 32 penguins here. And these are from South Africa? Yes. Not Antarctica? Not Antarctica. They're actually one of several species of penguins that prefer the warm climate. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Warm climate and penguins. I guess you learn something every day. <laughs> hey, let's take a seat right over here. And then Hutch is gonna bring a penguin over. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get to touch a penguin. Ooh, hello. <laughs> hey, so I'm gonna touch the penguin with two fingers gently on its back. So soft. Did you know penguins have 70 feathers per square inch? Yeah, they're really small and really dense. Can I touch the gam touch? Yes, you can. Yeah. Does that feel good? You like that? She's showing off for you. What does that mean when she shakes her head? So that means she's really happy, uh, and you might be her new boyfriend. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I hope she doesn't want to kiss. <laughs> oh, hello! This is a little blue penguin. It's pretty small. Whoa! And this board has the sizes of different penguins. Oh, like the penguin I met today, an African penguin. Whoa, and they just keep getting bigger. Whoa, whoa, look how big they're getting. Whoa, look at how big this penguin is. Whoa, four feet tall, 1.3 meters high? Jeez, look how big it is. Oh, whoa, that's a really big penguin. Can. <laughs> Do you see its beak? <laughs> kind of looks like the shape of a banana. A really colorful banana. <laughs> There's another bird over here. Come on. Whoa. Hello. <laughs> a colorful parrot. Hey. How are you? <laughs> Whoa. Looks like it's yellow, blue, and on its head, is green. <laughs> hey! Hey, there's another animal right over here I want to show you. Come on. Whoa, look. Look at this animal. It's moving really slow. <laughs> Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a sloth. Let's act like a sloth together.
Hello! How are you? Ah! 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 <laughs> That's funny. Alright, hello! These are otters, and they're so cute. Look at them go underwater. Whoa. I bet they can hold their breath for a really long time. Whoa. They're so fast. Whoa. <laughs> they kind of look like water cats, <laughs> but they're not kitty cats. <laughs> Whoa. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh, another one. learning about all these creatures at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona with you. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right, see you soon. <laughs> And today we're at the Pacific Science Center in Seattle, Washington. This is gonna be so much fun! Come on! Whoa! Look at this place! This place is awesome! Ooh! Now we're in the butterfly room. Have you ever seen a butterfly before? Yeah! I love butterflies. They're so beautiful and light. Will you act like a butterfly with me? Whoa, look at him go! Whoa! <laughs> There's one right there! Hey, butterfly! Whoa! <laughs> Check it out! A butterfly just landed on me. So anytime they land on you, you don't want to touch them. And they're actually just being really nice. So you can be nice back to them. See? <laughs> I love butterflies because they're so bright and, and some are camouflaged though. Look, can you find one? This butterfly uses camouflage for its defense mechanism. Just in case if there's any predators, then the predators can't see it. <laughs> see? <laughs> Hi! All right, now I'm with Lorraine, and what are you going to show us? So this here is a Madagascar hissing cockroach. I can take Ooh. it out for you. And what am I going to do with it? You can hold it if you'd like. Sure, let's try Take it. Out. I'm about to hold a Madagascar hissing cockroach. All right, hold your hand out really still. Ooh. There you go. Oh, that's nice. I like this cockroach. Hey, how are you? Hey. Do you see it? See, I'm being nice to it, and it's being nice to me. Hey, how are you? What did you do today? Did you enjoy your food? Yeah. Ooh, now we get to touch some animals. But first, we need to wash our hands. So then our hands are nice and clean. Okay, I think that's good. Let's go, come on. Ooh, look at this. Wow. <laughs> Hey, what do we have here? Well, over there we have some anemones. They're really friendly and kind of squishy. 
You're doing a really good job petting it with one or two fingers on the side. We don't really want to poke it right in the middle, because that's its mouth. Oh, cool. Ooh, look at this one. So the last ones are really soft. I wonder what this is going to feel like. Whoa, it looks like it's closing itself up a little bit. Blippi, it, it might think you're food. Oh, that's funny. Oh, look at this one. What's this? That over there is a sea star. How does it feel? Whoa. Kind of bumpy, maybe? Yeah, bumpy and, and, and kind of small spikes. The last couple were really soft, but this one is hard. Those little dots are made out of the same stuff that seashells are made out of. Ooh. So even as, though a sea star doesn't have a, its own seashell, it's kind of like it has little bits of a seashell. Wow, that's pretty cool. Well, thank you so much. My pleasure. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye. Oh, I found the queen. Wow, there's so many honeybees in here. Hey, don't be scared of honeybees. All they're trying to do is make some honey. Yeah. Have you ever had honey before? Yeah, it's so tasty. Look at what it is. This is the spot where you can do the bee dance. Are you ready to learn the bee dance? I'll teach you. Okay, in the middle here, you go and do a little wiggle. Then you go this way. Flap your wings. Yep, because we want to make some honey. In the middle, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And then go this way, flap your wings. And then since you're back in the middle, you wiggle, 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 and go this way. And then you keep doing it until you're really tired. All right, ready? Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Flap your wings. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Flap your wings. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Flap your wings. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Oh, I'm tired. Oh, that was awesome. Good job. Oh, now we're in the living things exhibit. Oh, look. Hey, look at what it is. It's a crayfish. Do you see it right there? Oh, here's one right here. Hey, how are you? <laughs> Ooh, and up top there's some fish. Hey, fish. Are you just swimming around? Yeah, they are. Oh, oh, look over here. Some giant grasshoppers. Ooh, grasshoppers can jump really high. I bet they live in the grass a lot of times. Eh, that's why they're called grasshoppers. A lot of times they live in the grass and they hop really high. <laughs> Let's go see what else there is. Another part of the Living Things exhibit. Whoa! Yeah, do you see these? Whoa, interesting. These are naked mole rats. Wow. They're like rats, but they have no fur or, or hair or scales or anything like that. That's why they're called naked mole rats. <laughs> oh. And an axolotl. Check this out. Whoa. See that? That's an axolotl. Whoa. So interesting. Kind of looks like a salamander mixed with a fish. But the cool thing about axolotls are if they lose a limb like their arm, then from there, they can regrow it back. Whoa. <laughs> Check out this little person or guy or girl or I don't even know but this is a turtle wow hey how are you turtle are you having a good day are you having fun yeah <laughs> you sure do look like you're having fun <laughs> see you later Whoa. it's kind of dark in here but that's okay this is a green iguana can you see it Whoa, it's just relaxing, having a good time. <laughs> All right, 
See you, Iguana. That right there is a dinosaur. They don't live on our planet anymore, but they used to. Look at it. It kind of looks like a velociraptor. Will you act like a velociraptor with me? Whoa, another dinosaur. Whoa, this dinosaur. That's its name right there. It's really big. Hey, look at its head. <laughs> Hey! See? It kind of looks like it's wearing a helmet. Just like when you and I ride bicycles, we wear helmets. <laughs> cool! Oh, here's some more dinosaurs. Whoa, look at that one. That is a triceratops. Do you know why they call it a triceratops? Yep, because it has three horns on its face and head. Let's count them. One, two, three! <laughs> All right, see you later, Triceratops. Oh. Hey, another dinosaur. Wow. Hey, dinosaur. Oh, this dinosaur right here was a herbivore. <laughs> see, these plants, that means it eats plants. <laughs> and plants only, it doesn't eat meat. And look at what's on its head. <laughs> it kind of looks like a shark fin. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Whoa. Check this out. Whoa, this is a massive footprint. Okay, let's compare my foot to this dinosaur's foot. Ready? Its foot is way bigger than mine. It's even way bigger than two of my feet. Whoa, another dino. Check it out. This is a Stegosaurus. Whoa, do you see those plates on its back? That's for its defense mechanism. Wow. Hey, Stegosaurus. <laughs> oh. So many cool dinosaurs in here. Whoa! This dinosaur is so scary. It's the king and queen of the dino land. Whoa! I'm gonna act like this dinosaur, okay? Will you do the same? Ready? <laughs> I love acting like a dinosaur. <laughs> Woo, now we're going to do the high rise bike. Oh, all right. Come on, come here. You got to buckle up. Whoa. I'll tell you a few quick things before you go. Okay. Uh, just make sure you're going at like a walking pace. You're always going forwards and just keep pedaling the whole time. Okay. Uh, hands are optional. Whoa, hands are optional. Here I go. Whoa. I would fall off because it's a really thin rail but I didn't because the weight is really heavy and it's really far away from me here I go Woo! <laughs> whoa look at this interesting this looks like a giant circle <laughs> and this is actually called the water wheel it's kind of just like how a hamster runs in their wheel I'm gonna do the same, but it's gonna grab water from the bottom and throw it up over the top. Ready? 
Here I go! Whoa! Did you see that? That was awesome! Whoa, what's this? Ooh, this is the water power station. Water is getting shot out on the front of this little water gun. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> okay, watch! I'll make that spin. Yeah, we're doing it! Whoa! Okay. Whoa, what's that way up there? Do you see that? Yeah. That's the Seattle Space Needle. I think we should take the water power gun and try and shoot way up there. Here we go. Oh, it's such a nice day. I wanted to give them a cool break of water, but it's too high up there. Let's go see what else there is around here. Pretty fun! Whoa! Look at this area! You can use these water squirters to squirt inside this clear cube! <laughs> Alright, let's see what else there is. Whoa! Look at this! Alright, I wonder if I put this right here. Yeah! See? The water is pushing this gear around. Okay, let's try this one. Whoa, look. Both of these are going in circle. The red one and the yellow one. Come on. I love playing with water. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Wow. Okay, look in there, let's go. Ooh. Welcome, come on in. Hey look, it's a little tree house. Here I go. Hello. Whoa. Whoa, look at this. It's a bunch of spirals, ups, downs, Lefts and rights. Here we go. Whee! Whoa! 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 <laughs> this is so much fun. Oh, the noise room. Come on. Whoa! This room is a room that you can make as much noise as you want. First thing I'm gonna do is yell. <laughs> now, let's use the things around us to make some noise. And if we're lucky, maybe it will sound like music. <laughs> Woo! Look, some shiny bowls. right up here. Whoa, this area has a lot of colorful bricks. Yeah, see? Right over here. All right. Timber! <laughs> Whoa, a taller one. Let's count how many there are. This is a lot of stories of bricks. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Eighteen bricks coming down! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that was awesome! Okay. Let's uh, organize these bricks in their different colors, okay? Okay, since we made a mess, we need to take the green bricks, put them over here, okay? Okay, there's the green bricks. And let's now take the blue bricks and put them right there. Awesome. Perfect. Oh, hey, look. Here's some brown bricks. Let's put them right here. Hey. Here's a red brick. Let's put it right there. Okay. Hey, here's some more blue bricks. Look at this one. What color is that? Yeah, this is brown. Let's stack it right there. Hey, look at all these. What color is this? Do you know what color this is? Yeah, it's the color yellow. Let's put these right over here. Okay, so when those 18 bricks fell down, they were comprised of these one, two, three, four, five colors, and those colors are green, brown, blue, red, and yellow. Good job. Let's see what other fun things they have at the Pacific Science Center. Let's go. Do you like numbers? Yeah, I do too. What about big numbers? Yeah! Check this out. This is a big number. 76,383,232. Whoa, that's a big number. But when I push this red button, watch this number. Whoa, it just went up by one. See, it's at three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. Every time you push this button, it goes up by one. So if you ever come to the Pacific Science Center, you can see what number it's at, because I am going to leave it at 76,383,323. Wait, no. 324. I'm just doing this puzzle of the moon. Okay, there's one. Let's see. Okay. Hey, there's another. Um, yeah, that looks about right. Perfect. We're almost done. Look. Yeah. This is our moon. We live on planet Earth. And we have one moon. And we call it moon. <laughs> wow, how clever of us. Hey, look at what it is. This is a planet. Just like how we live on planet Earth, this is a planet in our solar system. And this is Saturn. Oh, and the biggest planet in our solar system is Jupiter. Whoa, it is really big. Look at that. Come here. This is a space capsule. Watch your step. See? This capsule is where astronauts can sit in and go into outer space so then they can feel the effects of gravity. And they can push all these cool knobs. Ready? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! Look! I just made all those things light up! Whoa! This is fun! Whoa! 
Looks like I can see planet Earth all the way from out here. Whoa! Hey, Mom! <laughs> Woo! It was just a mirror. Come over here, I'll show you some more fun that we can have with mirrors. Ooh, look at this. Whoa. <laughs> I call this the mirror dance. <laughs> I look silly. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Bubble maker. All right, I'm gonna lift this up. Nice and slow. And I'm gonna blow now. Yeah, I did it! Did you see that? That was awesome! I love making bubbles. Ooh, and you know what else I love? Is taking a giant lever and seeing how distance way out here makes it really easy compared to to lift up this weight compared to hold down right here. See, watch. Huh, interesting. All right, now let's move it way out here. Now I'll do it with one hand. Yeah, did you see it? Look, I'll lift it up. Whoa, that's pretty interesting. Oh, hey, a cool mirror. Another one. Hey, hello, this is interesting. See, I'm upside down. But in real life, I'm right side up. Hello? Hey, I see you. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> All right, let's continue on. This place is so cool. Hey, what's this? This is a beach ball. What's it doing here? Flying ball. Feel the power of air in motion. Huh, interesting. Let's push this. Whoa! I wonder what happens when I plug this hole that's shooting up all the air. Whoa, did you see that? All right. Now I wonder what happens when I move it. I just hydrated my body with a lot of water because what I'm about to show you <laughs> takes a lot of energy. I'll show you my Lance Armstrong hill climb. Woohoo! That was awesome! Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B L I. PPI, -I. Blippi, good job. Special thanks to the Pacific Science Center for making this video happen. Bye bye. So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout, Blippi. <gasps> hey, it's me, Blippi. And today I'm at the Skyline Marina in Anacortes, Washington. And marinas are where boats live. <laughs> and today, you and I are gonna learn about boats. <gasps> Look, there's one right here. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. Woo! <laughs> Whee! I'm steering the boat. Whoa! This is so much fun! Alright, I'm gonna pull back the throttle. 
This is the throttle. This is what you use to determine if you go forward or backward. And this is the steering wheel. You knew that. Whoa, whoa. What else is around here? Oh, hey, I wonder what this button does. Whoa, did you hear that? <laughs> That's the horn. Let's do it again. <laughs> That's so much fun. Ooh, and what's this? This is a radio. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? This is Blippi. <laughs> Radios are used to be able to talk to the people on the land and other boats. Ooh, and a navigation system? This is electronic, and this one is not. This is actually a compass. It tells you which direction you're heading. Wow, that's so useful. Ooh, and there's so many gauges and instruments. Hey, and a muffin. Let's try some. Hmm. <laughs> So tasty. All right, check this out. Here we go. Let's go forward. Whoa. Whoa, yeah. Check out the back. Yeah, look. are amazing pieces of machinery. <gasps> hey, when you're in a boat, and if you are 12 years or younger, then you need a life jacket. So, let's open up this compartment and take out a life jacket. And this life jacket is the color orange. Okay, let me put it on. Life jackets are really good to keep you safe. They keep you afloat if you go in the water. Let me turn this around, go to the back. Perfect, make it nice and snug. How do I look? <laughs> Whoa, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Another piece of equipment that boats have on them is a life ring, and that's used to throw it off so then the person that's in the water oh, can grab onto it and then you can pull them in. Here, I'll go get the life ring. Whoa, check it out. This is a life ring. Whoa, I wonder why they call it a life ring. Hey, I know, because it saves lives and it's the shape of a ring. Hey, so let me take it, get it situated, and I'm gonna act like there's someone out there that needs help. So I'm gonna take the end of it. Okay, I found it. And from there, I'm gonna chuck it out there really far. Three, two, one. Yeah! Did you see that? And then once they grab it, then you can reel them in like this. Okay, grab on tight. I'll pull you in. <laughs> like we saved someone. There we go, <laughs> good job.
a boat and it's out of the water. See, normally the water is up to here. <laughs> but it's out of the water. Hey, and check this out over here. Come here. Oh, and do you see down there? Those are the propellers. Wow, they spin around and push the water back to create thrust for the boat to go forward. Whoa, hey, and look way up there. There's some buoys. Whoa, they're kind of like pillows and balloons so then the boat doesn't hit the dock and get hurt. Wow, this power boat is really cool. Has big engines to provide a lot of power to the boat. Whoa, look at this boat. This boat is a catamaran. Check it out. Wow, kind of looks hollow in the center. That's silly. And then kind of like a deck in the middle. Whoa, and how it gets power is from the wind. And then it blows on the sail, and then it goes! Whoa! Hey, look! Here's another type of boat. And this boat, yeah, it's a power boat. But what it's used for is fishing. Wow, I see a lot of fishing pole holders up there. I bet they go fishing for salmon, tuna, crab, and all of those tasty food. Whoa! This boat is really big. Look how big it is. Whoa! I look so small hey. next to it. And this boat looks so big. Wow. Sailboats get all of their power from their sail. Whoa. Hey, and what are these down here? This is called a keel. It keeps the boat really stable in the water, so then when the wind blows a sail, it doesn't fall over. Whoa! Sailboats and boats in general look like so much fun. Whoa! Whoa! Look! This is a kayak. And kayaks are another type of boat. Interesting. Kayaks are powered by humans going like this with paddles. And in here, there's more kayaks. Come on. Whoa. Whoa, look over here. Here they are. Wow. This kayak is the color red. Ooh, and back here, this kayak is the color yellow. Oh, oh, this one's hidden. But do you see this? This kayak is the color green. Kayaks are really fun because you sit in them with a life jacket on. Yeah, a life jacket. Whoa. Hey, let's try on a life jacket. Okay. Take it off the hanger. Oh. <laughs> All right. So this is a life jacket. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> and life jackets are really useful when you're near and on the water in boats because they keep you afloat if you're in the water. So then you don't have to go. Oh. <laughs> and sometimes if the water is really cold, you might wear a wetsuit. Oh, look at them back here. See, it's like their feet. And then the arms. And I think these are actually called dry suits because they actually keep you dry. So then the water doesn't touch you. Oh, let's see what else is around here. Oh. Wow. Yeah. The paddles for the kayak. Whoa! Whee! <laughs> this is so much fun! Okay, I'll go back this way. Whoa! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> oh, 
This building is so big! Have you ever wondered where boats get stored so then they can go inside away from the weather? Like the rain, the wind, and the ice? Whoa! Yeah, a building like this stores many, many boats. Hey, check it out! Doggy? <laughs> Look, this dog is being nice and safe with this life jacket on. Hello. <laughs> oh, so soft, so cute, and so safe. <laughs> Ooh, what a beautiful day it's been. Oh, Look, do you see what I see? Wow, yeah, sea life. Whoa, let's get a little closer and say hello. Hey. Hey, how are you? Wow, that's a seal. It's just laying out in the sun. It feels so good. <laughs> I'm gonna go a little bit closer. Hey, how are you? Wow, it's so cute. Look at its big black eyes. Hey! <laughs> Hello! I wonder what its name is. We should name it. I have an idea. Let's name it Seely. <laughs> hey, Seely! <laughs> All right, Seely. Have a good day. Bye bye! <laughs> Oh, I love the marina. Woo! -hoo! Look at how big this boat is. Wow. Jeez, it's so long. Oh, hey, it's so big it even has windows inside. Hello. <laughs> That's silly. Whoa, and look how tall it is. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't I start at the back of the boat and then I'll step it out and count the steps to see how long it is. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. This boat is 16 steps in length. Good job. Whoa. it is to have this muffin on this boat. <laughs> Let me show you around this boat. Whoa! As you saw, that was the table. Ooh, in this area is a great place to prepare some food. Check it out! A fridge! Hello, fridge! <laughs> you can keep all your food nice and cold. Ooh, in a sink? What's that doing in there? <laughs> so silly. <laughs> okay, what else is around here? Whoa, this boat is awesome. Check it out. Ooh, that's the captain. Hello. Hi. <laughs> He's steering the boat. And down here is the inside of the boat. Come on. 
Wow! This is amazing! Whoa, it looks like a stove top right here where you can cook some food. Ooh, a sink. Well, that's a big sink. Some paper towels, can't forget those. Ooh, a microwave. <laughs> oh, that's convenient. There's even a TV right here. Hey, that's me. <laughs> oh, in a bed. Oh. No time for sleeping. <laughs> Ooh, another table. I could eat tons of snacks right here. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Woo! A fuel pump. <laughs> That's gas. And this is diesel. Hmm, interesting. Hey, I have something to show you. Come here. <laughs> Just like how cars need gas and diesel to run on land, boats also need gas or diesel. And this boat right here needs gas. So, let's take this pump right over here and let's go fill it up. Whoa! What a long hose! Hey, check it out! This is the gas cap of the boat. So let's unscrew it. Okay, be very careful. And then put it right in there and pull the trigger. Did you hear that? It's nice and full. All right, let's put the cap back on. And now it's full to the top so we can have some fun in the sun. <laughs> hanging out in the water on this boat. I sure do love boats, and it was so beautiful out there. Hey, I have an idea.